To Kelly Towers, making art was not a goal, it was salvation. He spent his childhood in what he calls the middle of nowhere in Australia, watching Japanese flavored cartoons. When he moved to DC as a teenager, he learned to paint and began coloring the city to his liking. I was doing graffiti, um, really crappy graffiti. I wasn't really good at graffiti. Um, so basically, it, it, it was an outlet, though. And it was the first time I experienced like spray paint. Dallas' arrival in the late 90s coincided with the transformation in the city and the appearance of hundreds of vibrant murals. The city may not yet be able to compete with New York, Boston or Chicago, but more and more talented street artists are making their way to D.C. We're not known as these giant like icon monoliths of art and fashion, so us to be growing into that phase is really, really amazing. It's a kind of a renaissance cool thing that's happening right now. Talos' art is a combination of pop art and graffiti with a touch of those Japanese cartoons he watched as a kid. His tools, hundreds of spray paint cans and anything else that comes in handy in his perfectly organized studio. In a city awash in politics, the message he wants to send to both locals and tourists is universal and nonpartisan. Literally, if I do a mural, hopefully the vibe is or the thing is, if somebody walks by it, they'll, they'll just smile and be content with seeing something like that. Street art and graffiti is considered illegal in many cities, which makes it a tough career choice. It took Talos a long time and a lot of determination to make it work. Literally, that's what I've done. I've come from nothing. I, I've, I've done everything I can to make that dream happen. Today, individuals, restaurants, galleries and real estate companies commission Talos to paint their walls. Though Talos has always worked alone, in 2017, he agreed to become regional director of Pow Wow DC, an international mural festival that originated in Hawaii. Because it didn't feel like work at all. And we're all family, like we're all friends. We like we we've come in, into this culture and like celebrate each other and, and support each other. And it's really, really amazing and to have that build up more and more every year and to have it come to fruition and where people realize it's a benefit and they love it. Talos is not afraid to challenge people's ideas about what an empty wall can be, armed with a spray paint can and a smile on the wall. Anna Rice, VOA News, Washington.